hello guys a very good afternoon to everyone you're very much welcome to today's vlog this is blessing channel channel i'm very glad that you're able to join us today so so how is everybody and how is everything going with you guys over there if it's your first time of clicking into this very um channel you're very much welcome please subscribe and for those that have been with us how have you defined this channel and how is everything going with you guys so for us not to talk about much on this intro uh let's get it started and at the same time please for those that are subscribing please and those that have already subscribed please try and turn on your notification it's just immediately you just click on that subscribe there's a button a bell sign that you see by the side just click on this one whenever i upload a video you get to know that's on time all right see you later Say hello. Bye. Boy, you're supposed to be sleeping. <laughs> I have, um, oh my god, what is that? What did you just do? Eh? I go and sleep. You're supposed to be sleeping now. No, what's the time that this is four o'clock in the afternoon? So we are just chilling at home. What do you expect? We are just chilling, but look at this. One. <laughs> Look at this one. So we are just chilling back at home. There is nothing we are doing. We are just uh, like at home uh, watching TV. What else? And just like I said, at one time I said, this, uh, this boy is disturbing me. I love to say what I want to say. Eh? What kind of okay, don't let her. Don't worry. Let her. It's not a picture. So, like I was saying, I just pray that somebody would not increase in weight um, at this time of the period. Oh my God! Look at this boy. Do not allow me to do this vlog. Hmm? I go and sleep. Go and lie down there, please. Lie down on the other side. So I just put on cartoon for him, and that's why he's doing. His little sister is already on bed. Sleep. The two of them, I put them on bed to sleep, thinking that this one is going to sleep. Yeah. So I was even surprised when I got back to the room. The the girl, the, my daughter, is already on bed sleeping, and this one refused to sleep. So I just asked him to come out from the room so that he will not go ahead to disturb um, his uh, older sister. So, like I was saying, I just believe that this period, somebody will not go, will not grow much fat and add weight so much more that when we resume and everything comes back to normal. Well, yeah. I'm going to beat you now. So that when we resume and everything comes back to normal, that uh, we will not begin to yeah, have a much pound me. weight and the measurement that will be alarming. So that just, we're just at home chilling and having time to look through indoor, nothing much, just here. So get back to you. This is what um, they are up to. The other one is watching his iPad, and uh, the other one is inside um, the other room, my room, and he's just watching his phone too. So, this is just all about us in this period and in this very day. So, let's put on cartoon for the, the younger one to watch, but he's not even concentrating on the cartoon, he's just busy doing another thing. So just this is what our life has become for now till everything comes back to normal. Don't put off the cartoon and leave it so that just you can Gabriel is watching now. I want you want to off it. Huh? Gabriel. You want to see something to off the cartoon? No. You want to watch it. If you are watching it, then I put your eye on the cartoon. So that is just all about us for now, guys. Trying to look at our friends view a little and see what is going on around. I've not even been outside this morning. I've not even come out, even at this very stretch. I stretch myself a little bit. I'm an easy task. Might as well. to watch little cartoon now. 
Gabriel, is it you some said that you want to have the television just now? You said no. You don't want to watch you some phone. You want to watch that? You want to change the station? Hmm? I want to. Leave it in one now, okay? Wait, let me change it myself. Don't touch it, just hold on. Wait. You want to watch this one? Hmm. Let me change it to another one. Hold on, hold on, let me do it myself. Hey, what is this one now? This one is okay. Hmm? Why? Don't change it yourself. Just let me do it myself. Hold on. Go and see that. Let me do it myself. Why you don't press something now? As well. If it comes in now, it's sleeping now. You're here disturbing me. Hmm? And what is this one now? Oh, God, the orchestra. Better look at it. I advise you to Hmm? What is it? Huh? Why are you jumping now? There's something that is just going through my mind. I've just been having these thoughts and uh, this really is so troubling. Troubling as a talk is so troubling to me, especially um, the way our uh, crisis has uh, turned down. Governments or parts of governments of some countries, like the country I'm from, Nigeria. Things that I'm hearing there in the news is so pathetic. Why I, I say so is because now, this period, there are a lot of amenities that's been needed, and for those that don't know and those that have come across this channel and they don't even know, maybe my background, they don't even know where I'm from. I'm from Nigeria. And I'm really having a lot of concern. I'm speaking on behalf of the place where I'm from. I don't know what it is like in some other parts of African country because you know um, there are a lot of African countries that are not yet developed. They're just developing. Okay, the government of uh, countries, of African countries, are not even trying. Um, they are, you know, as a the effort they are putting, it's not like they are not putting the effort. I don't want to say they are not trying, but with the way things are, there is no improvement at all. Like I said, the news and the things I, I hear daily, it's just so um, alarming. There are basic amenities that is needed, especially in this time of the period, where you are asking the citizen of the country to stay back at home not to do anything, not to go to the market because of the risk that is involved with this um, this virus, okay? We're asking them to stay back at home and those basic amenities that they need, why they are home that they can use, can't even provide. It's not like they're asking you for you to feed them. They're not, they're not asking you to feed them, but why they are home, there is no good um, you know, electricity supply, there is no um, supply of water because there was one um, a lady that was making live video okay, talking about the crisis and uh, she really talks you know something that really hurts me you know really you know, I, I was so hot okay and she was you know raising her sentiments I was not so happy okay but the place where they live there is no water supply and the the water board that's what we call it in my place in Nigeria the water board the food that supply water Okay, to the public, uh, seized the water, and you know, water is needed this time around, especially washing of your hands. You know, it's been advised that we should wash our hands, you know, for 20 seconds. And when this water are not being supplied, and all these amenities, okay, are not being supplied, how will they be able to curb the effect of this virus? Because when you go out, you come back, you expect to wash your hands, you know, like that. and. Uh, Another one is just the issue of light. You're asking them to stay back at home. There is no light supply. Even if you finish paying your bills, 
you're expecting light to come you won't even see it if they manage to even give you the lights to use you do not even stay for you know much longer time so it's it's, it's really hot all right it's really hot i don't know how the feeling is really i don't even know how to describe it but i feel for my country i really feel for my country if there's anything that needs to be done please they should try i know it's not going to be easy with the way um it is over there but let them try even if at all it's just because now many of them where they end their livelihood is maybe by their goods and services that they sell and it's because going to the market you are messing up with different people and in that way you can never contact the virus and now if they are preventing them not to go to the market that is where they fed that is what where, where they feed that is where they the most part of what they use to take care of themselves is what they're able to sell for the day and they're asking them to stay back at home can even say, okay how are they going to feed those are just the thoughts that keeps coming through my mind because I I knew I know what the situation will look like, right? I really know what it will look like. I'm not there right now, but I know what it will look like. If it's possible for them to improve, if it's those uh, big big men and if those big personalities that are there, if it means you know supplying them with what they can, at least what they can eat, you know why they are home. It matters a lot. It matters a lot. And if there's any of us, we might not be that big. We might not be that, you know, popular. We might not be that rich. But if there are things that we can supply to people, those these days, even if I thought you are thinking of supplying to people, you don't even know who's having the virus. So everything is just, you know, uh, it's not going to be that freely for people to accept things from you. Now I'm hearing now in the news they said, uh, was it called this mask? That they supplied in Nigeria that is already contaminated. Those, those stuff and those news. So even if I thought you are supplying them with what like those basic like food, food stuff that they will use in keeping body and soul together before everything normalizes. You don't even know who is bringing. You don't even know there's any of them that have that virus. So I just pray. We all should just pray that everything should just you know come back. You know, it wasn't like this before. So even if at all, you know, something like this should come. We're not even expecting that it's going to look this like this. We're not even planning for it. So that is just all about that. I just hope. Just hope. But in no time, everything is just... There's a technology, everything is just stagnant. There is nothing moving, nothing is... You know, accessible this time, so it's a tough period for everybody. So just pray that uh, everything will come back and then uh, it will be okay. Hey guys, how is everything going with you guys? Yeah, I'm at the kitchen position. I'm just trying to sketch a rainbow. They asked my son to sketch a rainbow and uh, send over to the chat, the uh, group chat. The, the we have we have a good chat where we send discussion to the teacher no what i'm doing here just that for, for those that are with kids please how are we managing this period because now it's like we have turned to the teachers when these teachers were doing this job we don't know that we don't know that they are doing a very hard job but this time around we are now the teachers you know we are not the one doing this job a big time all right we have turned to the teachers you know then we we'll just send them to school i'm not even know what it is like but now so that's just what I'm trying to do here. Yeah. See you guys later when I'm about to close for today's vlog. So guys, we are done with our sketch. Let me just show you a bit of what we were able to do. Here is it. This is on rainbow that um is sketched. So submit it and you know. I'm back. So um that is just what we're able to do, just like I showed you. So we'll just have to wrap up today's vlog till we meet on the next one please like i always say please support me by subscribing and when you do just go to the notification part of that button that you subscribe there's a place where the word notification so that whenever i upload any video you'll be notified so just click on notification so that i get that for those that have not subscribed please try and subscribe for more vlogs videos and whatever that you want us to show on this channel so to meet the next one like i always say please stay sheltered and stay protected even in this period all right we'll meet later bye